we are going to go in and see what all the cheese is all about. Hello everybody and welcome back to the Misty Show. I'm so excited about today's video, I can't even stand it. But I'm standing in front of this big sign that says Mars Cheese. But that there is the Cheese Castle. It's right off I-94 here in Kenosha, Wisconsin. Mark is with me. Hi. We've never been here before. I can't wait to go in and eat some cheese. Let's go. All right, here we are at the Mars Cheese Castle. Now, Mario Ventura Sr. opened Mars Cheese Castle in 1947. The shop's name was inspired by its owner, as the name Mario comes from the Roman god Mars. The castle part of the name was inspired by a castle in Italy that was owned by his mother. Um, so this is actually the second building, the first, the original one. They had, they, I think they tore it down because of the construction of the interstate. The original building in 1957 burned down. It used to have a large beer bottle on the roof. Um, that this one was built nearby. And then in 2011, they put in I-94 and they had to build a new castle. So we're going to go in and see what all the cheese is all about. Let's go eat some cheese, drink some beer. Oh, they got carts. Do we need a cart for all of our cheese? You love a good cart. <laughs> Look at that. So, they, they got all kinds of beer. Which I know Mark is going to want to really look at all these beers. Well, there you go. Spotted cow. Look, they've got like a little castle for the, for the beer. I am not a beer drinker. So, I don't really care about the beer. I'll let Mark... I'll let Mark look at that. Look, fresh cheese curds. My word, this place is huge. They also have meats and salads. <coughs> My goodness, there's wieners, buns, nice selection of meats. Oh, it smells really good right here too. It smells like that meat's being cut. Man, it really smells good. I'm not a huge meat eater. But something's smelling really, really good. Look like these salami nuggets. Little antipasto here. Did you get your smell? So I know, that's what I just said. It smells so good. Look at all these cheeses that are in. We got queso, garlic. Jack of all clubs. Cheddar pepper jack cheese. It doesn't help that we're hungry. I know. Look, this spicy sriracha jack cheese. We need to have some samples. Look, there's even, look. There's even cheese on a rope. Provolone cheese. Look, there's even cheese shaped as a cow. Has Wisconsin. Has lips. Has beer. Has football. Has the cheese castle and as a tractor. We've got these little gift boxes that you can get. Oh, I'm gonna get some cheese curds. These are on clearance. Yeah, they squeak, squeaks. That's on clearance, Mark. You want pepper? I don't want pepper, garlic, and dill. What's this? You want garlic? No. No garlic. Churned by the Amish. Pepe, Pepe, say ya. I don't know. Mmm. Look at it all. Wow, blueberry cheese. Wildman cheese, cranberry, blueberry. If you don't like cheese, you may not like this video. But if you like cheese, you might be jealous of where I'm at. Ooh, these are cheese worms. Some cheese worms. String cheese whips. What? Cheese worms. They're jalapeno ones. Yeah. Oh, look, they got string cheese. What is this? I don't know what to do with all this cheese. Smoked mozzarella rope string cheese. Brick cheese curds. Oh my God. Cheese. Ooh, 
Look at all. Mayhem Jack cheese. Cheddar. Ch cheddar. Ye yellow, jalapeno cheddar. Yellow. Chipotle. Buffalo wing. I don't like stuff in my cheese. Look at that. You might like that. It's got meat and cheese. Yeah. Honey sriracha. Oh, here's bison. You want some bison meat? Yeah. No. I don't know what I'd do if I lived this close to the cheese castle. There's summer sausage. There's some more cheese curds here. Somewhere they've got samples. We need to find the samples. Somewhere they go. Oh, look, they got little. They got little carts for children. Oh, look at all the merch. I can get a cheese koozie. Wow. Pocket tokens. Pocket tokens. What's this? Popcorn? That's not cheese. <gasps> What's this? Cheese hats? I came in here because of these chairs. Those are pretty epic. What is this? A cheese sword? Are you kidding me? I'll get you with my cheese. That would be good a good death. If you got stabbed by a cheese cheese sword. This is a $19.99. What is this? That's a little cheese head. I need to I need to put on they got little baby cheese heads and big mama cheese heads. I'm gonna put on big mama cheese head. See, I am ready for battle in my cheese. With my Get cheese. in your throne. In your cheese throne. There's lions and everything in this on this chair. This is pretty epic. I feel like <laughs> royalty right now. This is like what I've li been living for my entire life is to be at this cheese castle. Looks pretty good. It's yummy. Look at, what's that? Cheese coaster. That's a coaster, cheese coaster. Mark says I don't need a cheese hat. They're $20. But look at these. Got cheese. Mars Cheese Castle. Those are $4.99. Man. They got cheese. cheese I saw that over there. That's fun. It's so squishy, too. What's this? Oh, it's a stress cheat. That, you really need to be really under a lot of stress for that, because that's really hard. Oh, yeah. That makes sense. I need that. Yeah, got cheese. Eat cheese or die. How much are Somebody those? Somebody had a shirt that said that. I might have to get a shirt that says that. Look at this. The cutest little cheese curd. <laughs> <laughs> That's adorable. What's your name, fella? What is your name? Mr. Cheese Mouse? You're cute. Oh, they got samples over here. And they got a bakery. They do have baked goods. Oh my gosh. Look at these Kringles. Mark. Look at that. It's a turtle Kringle. I don't know what it is, but it, it looks delicious. Banana cream. Pecan Kringle. Oh my gosh. So these are uh, samples of the baked goods. We've got cheddar cheddar cheese bread okay. you're not going to be able to see me eat it but i will explain because i'm not I'm filming with a different camera mm. that's the kringle mm. that is really good we may have to get that no i want that i gotta test this fruit pound cake that's lemon oh my that's good that's a used toothpick we want to get a new one <laughs> that cow just moved mark was telling me a little story about this cow i guess she used to be flocked no, she is oh, she is flocked. Oh, she was on the roof. Mashy, they given her a voice box. So let's see. I don't know how long, how often she she speaks. 
But this is Isabel. The Holstein cow. Isabel, you make good cheese, girl. Thank you for your cheese. Ah, uh, ah, uh, Isabel. Yeah. Ooh, $29 for four bottles of beer. Four bottles of beer on the wall. Four bottles of beer. Mars Cheese Outlet. Cheese. Cheese. Yes, I need that. $14.99. That's not a bad price. Look, I want to, I don't want to leave. I don't want to leave the cheese castle. So there is a restaurant here too, and we're gonna sit down and cheese, cheese, and more cheese. We're gonna sit down and get a little something to eat. And uh, Wisconsin. We're getting ready to order. We've gotta have to get an order of the world's best fried cheese curds. So I think, do you wanna just get that? You want, I mean, you probably want to get something else. That's good enough for me. They've got sandwiches over here. They've got liverwurst, Italian beef, VLT. They've got cheeseburgers, bratwurst. I'm just going to get the cheese curds for me and a drink. Sitting here looking, thinking that I might need to get me a crown from the cheese castle. No, I don't need it. We'll save it for the children. I've got a bratwurst and they have all these different, like, I guess, mustards and a green relish, jalapenos, spicy mustard back there. So you can get uh, some sauces for your brats. Okay, so cheese curds, the world's best cheese curds, right? That's what it said. Mar look at that big pickle. This is a potato salad. That does not look very good to me. That's like probably a German potato salad, I'm assuming. And he got a brat. You didn't get any like the relish or anything? So he got spicy mustard, cheese curds. I don't want mine dipped in anything. They had a butterscotch root beer. Mark got that. And then I got a Coke. But apparently Mark said that there is a bar. bar. So after we get done eating this, we're going to go into the bar. And I'm going to get a glass of wine. He's going to have a beer. And we're going to get a cheese plate. <laughs> we're at the cheese castle, Mark. It's good. I'm gonna take a bite. It's warm. Why do, I don't need a fork. We eat, we eat cheese curds with our fingers. I don't know about you, Wisconsin, but in Indiana, we use our fingers to eat. Let's see. They're a little kind of. I don't think that the fried cheese curds are supposed to squeak. I don't know. I mean. Are they the best you've ever had? They honestly might be. The action. What do you think? Oh, aren't they good? Yum. <laughs> okay, so we just got done eating the cheese curds. We're gonna go over to the lounge. I did get some dang butterscotch root beer. It's pretty dang good. I know, they got it in bottles here too. Sassafras. To say every time you drink it. Dang. Oh wait, Mark. The cheese samples. I don't know. Okay, so here are the cheese samples. We've got smoked, I don't like things in my cheese. So I'm not, smoked pepper. I just want a plain. What is this? Morel leak that has more. I don't want stuff in my cheese. <laughs> okay, I'm not trying any of these. They all have stuff in them. All right, so now we are in the lounge. As you can see, he got a, they have a nice little bar lounge area. Mark got a stout beer. What's it called? Sticky stack stout. Sticky stack stout. He likes a dark stout beer. I got a moscato because that's my jam. And we also ordered a small cheese plate. So when the cheese plate comes out. No, it's not. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Yum, yum. Take, taste your beer. Let's see what you, if you like it. Very good. Is it very good? Okay. Cheers. Oh, here, cheers, Mark. Cheers. Moscato. That's good because I don't like beer. I like Moscato. Our cheese tray has been delivered. 
So we've got four-year-old sharp cheddar, meat, chicken, chicken soup cheese. I don't know about that. This is a cheese spread. Artisan buffalo wing cheddar, baby Swiss, and blazers bacon cheddar. And then you got crackers, uh, maybe a honey, does it say what that is? Honey mustard. And you get little popcorn and little pretzels. And this was only $10. So that's a great deal. There's your beer, sir. I don't want that. That's yours. What do you think? What was that honey, like a honey spicy? Here, I'm gonna try mm. the baby Swiss. Swiss is more my jam. You know, a lot of people don't like Swiss cheese. I'm not one of them. I love Swiss cheese. Do you like Swiss cheese? Do you like Swiss cheese? Let me know in the comments. I think it's great. So yay. So I think it's a great deal for $10. Actually, a, a lot. There's a lot of cheese on this cheese plate. Honestly. So yay. All right, we just got done having our cheese plate, but I wanted to go back over here and look at the bakery again. Cause I'm thinking I want to get a baked good to take home. The cheese is excellent. The whole, everything in here has just been Everything in here has just been so fun. You can see over here they've got like a little pantry where you can get like pretzels and spice mixes, cookies, spices. Oh my gosh, look at this. Here's a seasoning from hell. But I kind of want to check out the bakery again. There's Isabel. We see over here is a refrigerator, refrigerated section of some frozen treats that you can get pudding pies pie baked in a paper bag oh wow oh, they got little ones too little pies baked in paper bags mm. but i wanted to check out this bakery stuff again because i really did like this bread which was the cheddar cheese bread wondering if they've got the cheddar cheese bread anywhere all right cheddar cheese bread right there all right, can I get a is this the cheddar cheese bread up here okay thanks thank you I get a loaf of the of the cheddar cheese bread it's 549 I think I am gonna get they also have fudge here as well but I think I'm just gonna get a loaf a loaf of your bread Isabel Thank you for your service. So everybody, that was the Mars Cheese Castle. It wasn't the lo that longest of a video, but I wanted to have you go with me. This was a lot of fun. It's right off of I-94, right just across the Illinois, Wisconsin border. Great place to go and have a drink, get a little snack. And I mean, if you love cheese like I do, then it's a must. But thank you for, for coming along with us. I really do appreciate it. Make sure that you're subscribed if you're not. I do have a main channel, Thrifter Junker Vintage Hunter. It is linked in the description. Hope you'll follow me over there as well. And yay for cheese. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Do you love shopping? I love shopping, specifically for vintage and antiques. But sometimes it's hard to get out and about with our busy lives. But I tell you what, there is a new way to shop for vintage and antiques, and that is at virtualantiquemarketplace.com, otherwise known as VAMP. There are over 9,000 active listings by over 200 trusted, vetted sellers that is guaranteed to ship your items within three business days of your purchase. It's fast, it's fun, it's all curated, true vintage and antiques over on Virtual Antique Marketplace. I am Misty and I am one of the owners. We would love to have you come over, become a member, it's totally free, and jump into these live sales, static sales, support small businesses over on virtualantiquemarketplace.com. Come on over and join in on the fun. <laughs> Da 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 da